Uh, good morning, guys. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today I'm uh, on a different job site. We're going to do some uh, small concrete pad. Um, I just installed uh, this Bilco door. I haven't finished yet, but almost there. I got to put concrete underneath there so I can put a screw here. Same thing on the other side. And I put a chimney flushing over there. Um, so that's almost done. And I removed the the old uh, Bilco door that was here and I just put a new one. So now we're just doing a concrete pad here. It's a small, I think it's like six and a half by six and a half concrete pad. Uh, we're just gonna, we just bought some, uh, we just bought some concrete bags from Home Depot. And uh, I'm gonna use our own mixer here. So we'll continue to do that. And like I said, that's just the concrete pad so they can come out from the door uh, on the concrete pad instead of uh, uh, dirt here. So we'll continue. It's quite windy here. Where the pouring went well, we just uh, mix our own concrete with our own mixer, and uh, this is where we stand. We need a couple more bags. We're just mixing it by hand, so we don't have to put the mixer nearby. And uh, we'll do we'll do some cleaning around, and then I'll start working on the concrete. Okay, I got it. It's okay, I got it. So Actually, just dump it. Yeah, there we go. That feels good. Okay, stop. One second. Stop. All right, just leave it there. Bring it over there. Yep. Bring it here. No. Alright guys, he's gonna use the bull slope. Nice and slow. Slow and flat. I use expansion joints all around here, except this uh, corner here. Yes, I didn't want too much space left behind concrete.
All right, guys, I just finished a magnesium trial, um, and this is what it looks right now. All that's left to do is just the broom. I'm just going to use the broom here, broom finish.